Let's talk with DJ Cappuccino. How's your feelings to Are you not conflicted? Because I know you love Mshodos. He's a man that we all love, including yourself. You put my t- He's a rebel rouser. He's a multi-millionaire. I don't know if a friend of yours owns a private jet or whether it's yours. <laughs> but maybe one day you'll tell us. I can just bomb your house when I feel like. But I don't want to do it. So you have bombs. You can actually take care of dollars. Pala pala. I do not want to talk much on the issue of pala pala. You no gave one. some Mickey Mouse people awards in that gala dinner. Which was talk with DJ Cappuccino. Thank you for listening to Just Talk with DJ Cappuccino. And if you're listening, please click on like or subscribe. We value your comments. We value your criticism because that's how the podcast will grow. Thank you again for viewing. Thank you for listening to Just Talk with DJ Cappuccino. And if you're listening, please click on like or subscribe. We value your comments, we value your criticism, because that's how the podcast will grow. Thank you again for viewing. Welcome to another episode of Just Talk with DJ Cappuccino. Welcome to another episode of Just Talk with DJ Cappuccino. I'm in studio with a friend, a brother, a business partner, biking fellow. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm with someone who wears many hats, someone who is a director of MPA investigation team, uh, someone who's also running Pico Charity Run Foundation, also running a Pico Productions, which is uh, dealing with events like including the Masquerade, Northwest Tour, which is a biking tour, uh, Northwest Mining in Daba, Pizza Takale. I'm sitting also with a, a, a political leader. Uh, I'm sitting also with the treasurer of Sanko, who's also uh, on the fundraising heading the fundraising committee team of Sanko nationally. Uh, I'm sitting with the former president of Sapayopa. I don't know to say whether you are still president. Or, you know, it's confusing, <laughs> uh, this Sapayopa thing, but we'll get to that later on. But I'm sitting with someone who's running a lot of companies and who I've seen, and I actually wonder if he sleeps, because uh, before you know it, he's in Saudi Arabia, he's in Qatar, he's in Angola, he's in Mozambique. He's actually everywhere. I'm sitting with Martins Antonio, we know him as Pico Santana. Welcome to Just Talk with DJ Capacito. No, thank you, DJ. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the opportunity that you gave me to come to your studio. And I believe uh, this studio is growing mm. and this studio should make a difference in the society. Oh, no, thank you. It should not remain a normal studio, but let's make it a DJ Capacino FM. Mm. We talk. Because I believe it will open and give an opportunity to a lot of people who our voices are not being heard out yeah. there. Yeah. Uh, this is actually the opportunity for them to come forward. Uh, I want to say to the viewers, to the listeners out there, uh, make your ways to be part of this program because this is a very wonderful program for me to accept to be here. It's because I've been following the program and I've then discovered that it's actually a brain opener for many and eye opener for many. So thanks for the opportunity. Good, good to have you here. Uh, Santana, you know, I, I think there's confusion about where you come from. And I want uh, you to take us to that, uh, that little boy. Uh, how you grew up, where you grew up, where you from. I want you to touch on that. I know that you're a man from Pomfret. And I also understand the history of Pomfret uh, with regard to the soldiers from Namibia, uh, soldiers from Angola, uh, who were assisting, captured, some came, then there was a base and stayed in Pomfret. I think you can break it down very well as a child from Pomfret because I also see, I've seen that you have programs that you're running uh, annually uh, in terms of charity, in terms of community building, in terms of workshops and everything. But take us there. Where were you born? Where did you grow up? How was it? All right, thank you. Um, firstly, I want to, to say that uh, my surname is Antonio. Antonio is a big surname, it's a surname that dominates. Uh, within our surname, we got chiefs, we got leaders, we got business people, we got uh, people that are listed as a rich in Africa and etc. That's where my surname comes from. Um, my father is a soldier. My mom was working in the army. 
my father is actually retired, uh, retired in the military of South Africa, served under the South African Defence Force. I was born in a, a small place called Pomfret, uh, called uh, Pikapau. Pikapau is an army base. For those who understand politics and follow the history of war, um, 1975, 1975, 74, there was a break of war that took place in Angola. And it was a very serious war where people then had to escape. So my mother and my father, they met at the, the camp. When I'm talking about a camp, it's called the refugee camp. The refugee camp was actually in a place called Botswana. So from Botswana, it's where then there was the uh, division. By that time, it was Southwest Africa because there was not uh, Namibia in South Africa. Southwest Africa was covering the whole of uh, the borders. Yes. So by then, there was a, a white guy called Bretenbach. He's the one who, who came up together with the late uh, Kyoto. Kyoto is actually a, a, one of the soldiers. Everybody called him the commandant, Kyoto. There were some discussions and so forth and issues that happened and my father was actually forced to be part of the South African defense. For those Angolians who were part of the South African defense, if you go look onto their force number, it says 76. Mm -hmm. So meaning the 76, they were automatically uh, incorporated into the defense of South Africa. Mm -hmm. Yes, I understand by the time it was more of a, uh, how can I say, it was a, a white regime. Yes. But remember, a military camp or any military, they do not play a role in any politics. They save the government of the day. So as they save the government of the day, my father then served under the apartheid regime as a, a military and he served on the new South Africa as a military. He was the 2IB of the military hospital in Luatla. Luatla is one of the biggest base, training base mm -hmm. in Africa. Mm -hmm. And is the biggest, I think, if I'm not mistaken, or the second biggest in South Africa. Mm. Um, my history on growing up, I'm from Pomfret. Uh, I went to pick up our school initially. And due to the effect of these issues of corporal punishment, and by then I was involved into politics, we were actually fighting because of the abolishment of corporal punishment. Uh, where if I remember correctly, our first very serious strike that we did was in uh, 1996, mm. October 1996. Uh, to that strike where it then created a situation that even the, the police, uh, the army had to come to school. We locked the gate. I can remember a few guys like uh, it was me, it was uh, Time Da Silva, it was Mazambi, Pedro, it was uh, Patkos, uh, and few others. We were the guys who were actually the front line to create that, that uh, movement in terms of that strike that uh, schools had to close mm. for roughly three to a month. You have always been an activist. Yes. Mm. Uh, and why we're doing that? We're not doing that because we wanted to destroy the school, but we're trying to stop corporal punishment in the school because a black child by then were mistreated. And if we could not stand up, it would have become a problem. Mm. Uh, police, white police from Porch, then were de deployed to Pomfret with dogs to be able to come and for us to be arrested. What didn't happen? Uh, we got a guy called uh, Miku, for those who know him. He was then taken to the, to the mine because Pomfret has a mine. 
Mm. It's actually our mine is an asbestos but what mine. What are they mining? Asbestos. Yes, but it's an, uh, remember it's now abolished by law. You're not allowed to have that mine running. Yeah. Uh, so the mine was actually there and it was not functional. So he was taken there. They tied him up because he was one of the guys who was part of those guys who were fighting. And we retaliated. Mm. We retaliated to a point that we in, even end up fighting the 2IB of the military camp to an extent that they said the students are now becoming very aggressive. But I hear you had guns. Which one? I hear you had guns. Cancer. Guns. Guns. No, remember, I'm in the army camp. There is guns, there's bombs, yeah. there's grenades. It's, it's, it's one of those uh, uh, school revolutions or activism that involved guns, and you guys were heavily armed. Young no, no, as you were. No, 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 no. Uh, where we grew up, there is guns because it's an army camp. And it's not only an army camp. Mm. It was one of the best camps of South Africa. Yes, because they took the best soldiers from Angola. Yes. Yeah. So the, the equipments were there, but we were not entitled to those equipments. You would steal them? No, 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 no. We did not. Def we defeated them <laughs> mentally and physically. Yes, we defeated them. Yeah. The white uh, supremacy, we ended it there in Pomfret. So because they could not uh, manage us, they then had to involve guys of Porch and others were taken. So I, had, I was so lucky that I ended up running to Freiburg. And then I continued my studies at Freiburg because I left, when I left Pomfret, I was doing Standard 7. By the time it was not great, it was standard. Mm -hmm. I left standard seven, then I moved to Freiburg. And when I moved to Freiburg, I was actually not really welcome back because I would have maybe been arrested or so oh. by then yeah. because the army was in charge. Yes. And other guys could not even join the army. They did not have an opportunity because why they were listed as troublemakers. And... and I've seen, I've been to many of your family events. Yes. Many are soldiers. Uh, yes. Saw the ranks of... Yes. I think even you, you were supposed to be a soldier maybe. The, the whole root of us is yeah. within the army. That's our root. Yeah. So definitely after I went to, to Freiburg, uh, I was then registered at uh, uh, Freiburg High. Mm. Uh, but Freiburg High, it was also an apartheid school, yeah. to be very clear about it, because we blacks were one side, whites were on the other side. And the Bayamans can need that you brought Hoi Africans. Yeah, safer Africans. Yeah. And safer also, they don't know that you speak to other. You listen to them talking <laughs> about you, <laughs> pretending that you can't you can hear what they say. They don't know that you even speak the purest one. Yes, yes. Yeah. You see? Mm. So then uh, it was a problem again for me. Why? Because... I was coming from a place where we were trying to fight the system. And my, my parents then put me in another school where I find the system is even worse. Now you have, must fight again. I must fight again. And by then I was staying at uh, Colenda. Uh, yeah, yeah I, was, I was at Colenda Hostel mm. with the colored boys. Yeah. So it was now difficult because when you go to the colored area, now you are being pushed to become also a bully. Then when you go to the school, you are now being run by an Afrikaner. Yes. So it was the system was not really favoring me. To a point that uh, I end up then going to uh, Kismet. I went to Kismet. And then at Kismet is where I did uh, my studies until Standard 9. Uh, Kismet is an Indian school. Yeah. It was one of the best schools in the Northwest as well. I went to that school. I did my sports there and so forth. But while I was in Kismet, uh, I was also having a bit of a challenge to effect of saying that they were already aware that I'm in that school. Because then I was looking on the issue of saying that, hey, I might not even end up finishing school because these guys, maybe their investigations are linking. Right, the troublemaker school. is there. Yes. Mm. So I then was forced, strategically so, to go to Kimberley. Then I was at William Pescott. Hmm. So I did my matric at William Pescott. So these are boarding schools? These are boarding schools, mm. yeah. 
uh, uh, when I was at uh, William Pescott, I was supposed to stay at a boarding school, but it was full, then I was staying at Floors. Mm. Uh, and I was schooling at William Pescott. But Biko, I, I, I get that, ne? Yes. But I also want us to, for the sake, because I can see that if we continue with the story, we're not going to finish now. Yes. Uh, but I, I yeah. want to know also, I can see your political influence, where it's coming from. Yeah. But with you now, being the treasurer of Sanko in Northwest, I mean, I've seen your involvement in the NC. Uh, I've seen you in campaigns. I've seen you also personally donating money for programs of the ANC. I want now, I want the senior politician in you. How did it come? I want that journey, if you can take us there. Yes, actually, I joined the ANC in 1996. I served under uh, Bosman in Freiburg. By the time it was the youth league side of, of the day, so I served under him. And definitely through that, I was always a disciplined member of the ANC. Mm. And I was following all the programs of the ANC to a point where I had to wait for me to be into where I can be or into power and so forth. Mm. Um, I am the chairperson of uh, one of the branches in Mafikeng, uh, Ward 33, yeah. the chairperson of the branch. And not only being at the branch chairperson, I'm also the secretary of the ANC Bikers National. Um, I believe that uh, it's, it should be not about me, but about those that think we can make changes in the society. Mm. And through the programs of the ANC, I believe we should also be thankful that we do not have everything that we wish to have. Because remember, we blacks, we like everything for free. We don't like to work much. But uh, the ANC, I believe, played their role. They gave us the opportunity. And through those opportunities, we got jobs, some, some went to good schools, some could manage their own lives. Uh, there are some challenges here and there, but it's fine. It's part of life because even in any house, it's like that. Um, I am a member of Sanko. I'm a member in good standing of Sanko. I belong to a branch. Uh, we had our elections as Sanko. And there I was elected as a provincial treasurer of, of Northwest mm. that I'm currently serving. And not only that, I'm also the head, mm. the fundraising of the whole South Africa in Sango. It's an opportunity and they, I believe they, they saw the responsibility in me to invest, to invest such position to me. Mm. And I'm, I'm happy with that because it shows that uh, out there there are people who can see the good out of what I do. And it's also good because it shows the accountability in terms of responsibility of whatsoever I did or do. Mm. So going to politics side, we all know that it's, it's not something that everybody will appreciate. That's why there's a lot of organizations and so forth. But let's not forget that Sanko is an alliance of the ANC. Yes. And let us also not forget that you are a member of Sanko. Because you live in a society, in a community. Okay. Sanko is the community. Community Sanko. Mm. Uh, Sanko is there to voice your voice, to be heard where it needs to be, and we are the watchdog mm. of the ANC in the society or in the community or any party. Yes, that or any party. Yes. Yeah. Because we we should understand that. Uh, we want to put people accountable. We, we are there to allow government to govern, but we are there to watch are they governed correctly or not, because why? The corruption system that is currently there. That's why our people are not getting what is due to them or what is deserved. Corruption system coming from where? The corruption system actually initiated in the time of the white supremacy. That's where it started. Before 94? Uh, before 94, yes. Okay. But as well as you know that uh, us... The captains uh, inherited it. Yes, but us coming into the system, we now want to, to put it as championing the system while the system has been there. And because found, if we want to champion the you system... You found your people doing corruption. No, remember, it's been there. 
I, I understand. But we do not, we are very scared to point and say uh, the, the land has been taken through corruption. Yeah. Yes. So we want to make it look good by saying uh, <laughs> we, uh, we need to get it in this way and so forth. Because if you go and ask the Reblanche surname today, mm. how did they obtain the land? Such hectares of land. They are not going to be able to provide you a paper. Why? Because his auntie or uncle was a municipality manager. Especially the arable, the most fertile land. Yes. Taken. And yes. If you go to if you go to the northwest, if you go to the northwest, if you drive from Mafikeng all the way to Freiburg, mm. all those lands on the side belong to white people. That street route. White people. Mm. Now you want to tell me that it was not corruption. When we tell them, please provide at least a, identify yourself in terms of how much did you pay. But for it the took land. you almost thirty years. You, no, you thirty years. Thirty years. Thirty years. Even years when is nothing. you had outright majority to. No, you see, we need to clarify something that is very important. The ANC up to so far did not really rule much, comparing to those who went to power for three hundred years. We need to be honest. We're just in the beginning phase. No, no, no. We actually needed to look onto phases. Mm. I know that people are trying harder to have the ANC out of power. But the truth and the reality is we should have stand together and say that no, the ANC did not rule much. Let's give them enough time and chance. Why? The processes are like this. Mandela was the president. The time of Mandela was the issue of reconciliation and create, bring us to Reconstruction and development. Okay. Yeah. But let us not forget that when Mandela came into power, he, he got, for example, debts and others that came from the previous regime. And, and before the transition, yes. they also took money from, well, they, they did things. Because those guys yeah. knew that they are going to be out of power. Some left money. to Australia and... I don't even want to talk about the Rupets and the rest. Mm. Because if I have to talk about those guys, it will be another issue. Yeah. Elkermans and the others. So when Mbeki came into power, we need to understand that many people say, no, President Mbeki, this President, President Mbeki was actually there to look onto the economy of the country. Even though we did not give him the full chance, but he did very well as well. Oh, no, what was his policy program? Uh, he, he, was, he was actually more focused on the issue of creating changes and making sure that the economy of the country picks up. Because if you look well, uh, when Becky was a president, he was not so visible in the communities and so forth, mm -hmm. but he was focusing mostly on the economical system. Of the country. And he was one then, of those presidents forever out of the country. Yes, that's why we had a very good values in terms of our uh, uh, our values of capital and uh, the, the, the rent mm. and even the properties. Mm. Even your investment was very good by the time comparing to now. Because I remember, I think by the time you were willing to, to even invest up to about 50 million without being scared. Mm. It, that's what Mbeki did. When Zuma came into power, President ah, Zuma. Yeah, I'm interested. Yes, when President Zuma came into power, <laughs> it was now the issue of saying he was more a president of the people but not of the country. So that's why we have Mbeki, the president of the country, not of the people. Zuma, the president of the people but not of the country. That is the difference that we need and to understand. Matamela? Matamela now is, is creating, trying to do all in his best in terms of stability. And that stability... So instability was caused by is, who? No, I'll, I'll come to that if you want to. Okay? Now, Zuma, when he came a president, if you go and check on his nine years, okay, he was more... The be, nine wasted years. No, it was not wasted. No, I, that's what they Politically, they want to I'm paint it that, that way. Yeah, yeah. Yes, politically, they want to paint it that way. You know why? Because media, like you, a media house, you are an enemy of the ANC. So you want to make the ANC to look as weak as possible. But you know that yourself to run this media or to have the opportunity even to sit here with a very nice mic like this one is because of the ANC. You know because what the I, time well, of apartheid, they were not allowing us to do Let me tell you things. what I checked yesterday. Yesterday I was watching this clip of uh, President Zuma sort of conducting a choir 
with the ministers, the cabinet. Yes. And even Cyril Ramaphosa there, yes. like singing and everything. And I was like, they say it's nine wasted years, but they were with him. No, you see. Almost all of them were with him. You see, uh, we, need, we need to understand it very well. Mm. Each president on his time mm. did whatever he had to do. He did well and he did bad. No one can stand here today and say, this president just did good. I can yeah. even tell you, some people say Mandela is a sellout. Yeah. Okay? It was our first black president. They say Mandela is a sellout. But why are they saying that? Because some of them does not understand that if Mandela would have not done certain things, we would have not been where we are today. Would not so be sometimes we need to compromise certain things and we need to accept certain things. Some people said, no, Mbeki must go uh, because of the AIDS program. Mm. Today, they are saying Mbeki is the best president. Mm. That's what they're saying. Some people were saying, no, Zuma must go, Zuma must go, and so forth, when he was still within the president of the ANC. Mm. Zuma left. Later on, if you go, the same media today, he said, no, Zuma was the best. Why? Because now uh, Matamela is not giving them the space to breathe. I, I want to narrow this thing now. Now. So that it can have a personal touch. Yes. You used but to, but, you, but you, before, you, you narrow, before you narrow that, yeah. we need to clarify one thing yeah. and accept that the ANC never had any nine years of a wasted, wasted years. The ANC had nine years in terms of creating constructions and functioning system that the whites did not like. No, I don't believe in the nine wasted years. It's impossible. Okay, thank there's, you. There's, now we're on the same page. The ANC has been working. All right, no problem. Good. Fine. Now, I want to narrow this thing so that it can have a personal touch. You used okay. to exploit me a lot. Yes. I used to drive you to Nkandla. Yes. Uh, and you used to see President Zuma. Yes. You have a personal relationship with yes. him. Yes. I still remember the other time I sat in the car for about five hours. Yes. And you were having a meeting with him. Yes. Now that he has formed, uh, I don't know whether I say his party, or now that it's like he's swaying away from the ANC. Yes. But he's saying he's trying to fix the ANC. Yes. Uh, uh, how's your feelings, Stuart? Are you not conflicted? Because I know you love Mshodos. No. Remember, uh, as a politician, we need to be honest to ourselves. You love him? Look, Mshodosi is a man that we all love, including yourself. <laughs> is a president of charisma. Yeah. Is a president that uh, the Gogos like because he sings very well. Is a president to understand the history of this country. He was in Northwest yesterday. Did he call you? No, no, I was not in the Northwest yesterday. Did he call you? No, no, he didn't call me. He didn't call me as yet. He might call, but he didn't call me as yet. But the thing is, he's a president that we all love, okay? Mm. Not president, former president, okay? Mm. Now, we need to differentiate two things. It's the same as a girl. You date this girl, you break up with her, it does not stop your friendship. But you're no more a boyfriend. But the contact remains. Mm. Okay? So we need to be very clear about that. Musholozi took his own decision that he wants to form MK. I was not part of those meetings. Yeah. But it doesn't stop him being my friend. But you were invited. You didn't come. Yes, but it doesn't stop him being you were invited. My friend. Yes, I was invited. I can confirm I was invited. Yes. I was invited, but with me, I can stand firm and say I'm a member of the ANC okay. in good standing and a very disciplined member. I don't just jump for positions. Yeah. Because why? I came from the ranks of the youth league. And we should not be excited mm. for the sake of new staff. Okay. Yes. He, he's a, he's a, uh, Mshulose is a very potential uh, currently damage to the ANC. The youth league of okay. Mbalula and uh, Julius Malim. That's where uh, you come from. No, look, uh, those, th those are actually, even now as we're speaking, eh, you know, uh, Julius came from the ANC. Yeah. is a product of the ANC mm. and is actually moved to where it is today, not because of anything. It's because he's very committed into politics and he understands politics and is, uh, uh, how can I say, is, is more within the community, is more within the youth and is more understanding the program of the youth. Mm. So he's growing well. He's growing well. And to be an opposition is not a, a crime. Yeah. It's not an issue. So I don't think Mushulose did anything wrong. It's his decision and his choice. But what I can guarantee you mm. is that the ANC is not going to be out of power. Mm. I still have to be a minister as well. There. 
Mm. And we're going to fix that problem. And after fixing that problem, because you're going to be my chief of staff anyway, you'll be working in my office as my chief of staff. Uh, yeah, well, I, I don't know. But yes. Uh, we'll see uh, what's going to happen with that. I just wanted to check your sentiments toward the MK thing and Zoom. I know that you love Zuma a lot. Yes, yes, yes. In fact, and, look, and I'm glad you are confirming that you were invited to the meeting. Yes, yes, yes. And you decided to just go once and stop going. No, no, no. I, I never attended any meeting. Because I remember, we should understand that it goes the same with uh, Julius. Mm. Julius is a member of the EFF. Yeah. But it doesn't stop him to be a friend of Mbalula. Mm. What we do on our free time has nothing to do with politics. Mm. And we should it's relationships you can't, you can't cut. They go beyond politics. You yes. are brothers. Yes. Yeah. You see? Yeah. Because why? Uh, we need to understand that it, it was Msholoz's own choice to decide to do what he did because he knows why. Mm. It was the ANC's decision maybe not to support him when he needed to support. We don't know why. Yeah. It's his own call. Uh, but for me, we wish him well. Yeah. Ace uh, Mahashule, we wish him well. Uh, others, uh, I mean, you, you, Shilowa was speaking now recently about the criticism of the ANC into Zoom. Mm. So we need to look onto some aspects that create people to <clears throat> to react the way they react. But the fact of the matter remains one. Zuma is a good man. Uh, he was a, a very good former president, even though many does not want to accept because media wants to paint him. Mm. But in the long run, they will realize that because remember, one of his main problems was about the nuclear issue. Today we are crying for the nuclear. Was he better than Matabel? Uh, let me not compare presidents. Not because everybody got their own strategy of leading. As much as me and you, when I was a president, I had my own way of leading. When you were president, you had your own way of leading. Mm -hmm. So let us not compare that because each one has their own strategy. Not but all the presidents of the ANC are good presidents. Uh, Pico, I want us uh, to now focus on the MPA investigating. Yes. Team, your company. Yes. I mean, you have went as far as getting contracts yes. in Africa. And I see you a lot in the Middle East lately. Yes. And I think you're also working on something. Yes. Even sometimes when I call, you'll say I'm with the Saudis. Yes. Sometimes I see you. I don't know if a friend of yours own a private jet or whether it's yours. <laughs> but maybe one day you'll tell us. I see you in a private jet going to these places. I want you to take us through you know, the security business and, and your involvement. Okay. Just Talk with DJ Cappuccino is hosted by Merupa Casino and Entertainment World. There's so much you can do at Merupa Casino. Let me tell you what I do, how my day looks like. I start at Casper Restaurant. I have breakfast, the freshest breakfast ever. Fresh fruits, yogurt, cheese, and anything that I need for breakfast. And after that, I move to Wild Things where I can even go to Best Park, Snake Park. But what I enjoy mostly at Wild Things is the pools. I swim until I get tired because swimming is exercise, it's refreshing, and it's beautiful. After that, I go to House of Ashante for a massage. They know what they're doing. I'm telling you, when those people touch your body, you'll never be the same again. After that, I move. I go to the casino itself to play the slots. I always win, and I don't know why. Every time I go play something at Merupa Casino, I just win, 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 no matter what. Then after that, I go to Marimba restaurant to have my freshest steak. And remember, by that time, it is in the evening. Then after having my steak, or the lamb, the lamb shank, which I believe that is the best lamb shank in town, that's when I go to Jembe Lifestyle to have fun. It's nice. People come there. I network, there's always someone to talk to. There's always a stranger who says, hi, how are you? And that's the reason I go there. And after that, I go to a Miropa hotel, call it a night, in those white sheets. Just talk with DJ Capuchin. Um, in fact, I am coming from a security background. I went to school, I studied security as well. Yeah. Because I remember the time when we were actually doing security or decided or took decisions to study that. It was not about going to university, but it was more colleges. That's why if you even go and check my qualifications, I'm more referring to colleges. Because by that time, universities were not giving 
uh, those type of training. For example, I'm a demining engineer. No, way, when I'm talking about demining engineer, is we work with explosive, we form a mine, we diffuse a mine, and we break it off and so forth mm -hmm. because of the landmine work. So South Africa itself, there's no school that can go, uh, even university, that will teach you that. The only way you're going to get the training, it should be through uh, DNL. Mm. So definitely a qualified DNL. Uh, I'm a QA as well. Okay, I'm a QA as well. Uh, I'm a, there's a lot of other training that I did. Mm. Uh, I'm actually an investigator. I did cyber. I did... There's a lot of other trainings that I did. I see you did uh, yes, yes, the yes. explosive device, device awareness, yes, yes. vehicle born divine awareness, you did vehicle formation, yes, formation in and ambush and attack. Everything. You, you, you know. did all those things. Yes, so that means I can attack you at any given time. I can just bomb your house when I feel like, but I don't want to do it. So you have bombs? We can create, we can make that. That is simple to do. Uh, yeah. can I so, so, mm. so, so definitely, uh, look, South Africa is a country that has a problem with employment. Mm. And CIRA, when it was formed, was to control people out there who are actually registered with the security industry mm. to be able to check because when you do security work, you need to be vetted. There, there's a lot of other programs that you need to focus upon. So I was one of the guys that uh, I was actually lucky that through one of the works that I was uh, doing, I managed to get an opportunity to go over the, outside the country, where I worked, for example, in Angola. Mm. Uh, in Angola, I, w I went there to work for a certain company called Safa, and then I ended up being a partner of mm. Saracen. Saracen is one of the biggest uh, security company that uh, does work in Africa. Mm. I actually, myself, I'm owning 60% uh, of the company in Angola, mm. and Saracen is in uh, Somalia, is in other places as well. Mm. Um, I worked, for example, in Central Africa for a long time. For, I worked for Nala. Nala is a diamond uh, mine or diamond center and so forth. I was running that operation because we were doing the control of the, of the diamonds and the movement of the exports of the diamonds and so forth. I was in other places as well because uh, I believe us as South Africans in terms of uh, expertise, Mm. were very good comparing to other places and other places of Africa. And definitely for you to have a very serious type of work like the one I do, you need to be very disciplined, you need to be very honest, you need to understand what are you doing, mm. and you need to make sure that your name becomes something before yourself. Mm. And I work with very serious people. I work with people who are actually very serious in the world. So definitely it needs a lot of and a lot of and a lot of responsibility because if they come to you and they just give you, for example, I'll give you an example, a case where there's about, let's say, uh, $20 million and say this money needs to be escorted from point A to point B and maybe you guys are two or three taking that money. Mm -hmm. Some people's mind will already be in the issue of stealing the money. And so because you can... You can uh, uh, for instance, you can actually take care of dollars from anywhere, from U.S. to yes. Pala Pala. No, remember, I do not want to actually talk much on the issue of Pala Pala. Because no, I, no, I'm I, not going there. I'm yes, just saying yes. you, 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 have, you can protect money it, it, until it reaches yeah, anywhere. Yeah, if, 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 Any I, couch if, if I get a contract to take the money to Pala Pala, I will. Because mm. I don't care about... Pala Pala. I care about my company the job, yeah. and the job that I'm appointed and deliver the service that I was requested to be rendered. When it gets to Pala Pala, when the other guys come there, I got nothing to do with it because my duty is to deliver. And I deliver and I'm done. You're not because the I'm one put putting it under the couch, yeah. No, 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 no. I put it on the table, the count and confirm, sign and I go. That's my duty <laughs> and responsibility. Yes. No, I see. I want us to move to your events company. Yes. Uh, I know that... You secretly want to be me when you grow up. Uh, you stole the masquerade from me after my <laughs> 40th birthday. Uh, I've seen that you're also doing Pizza Zakale Awards, which is a very brilliant program. Yes. Uh, uh, after you saw me doing awards, but you, you went for the big guns. I mean, you awarded Petrus Mutsepe. 
you awarded uh, uh, Desrielis, you are awarded Itumelen Kune, you awarded uh, Hugo Bruce, the coach of South Africa, Bafana Bafana, uh, Viola Mutsumi, like giants. I think you did it uh, way above my scope. Uh, you also having a Northwest biking tour, which I believe that you used uh, the name of Sapayopa, then now you're owning it. But initially, you were just using Sapayopa as a step ladder, and I don't want you to come in there. I'm just <laughs> telling you what you did. Uh, <laughs> uh, but we're having very interesting progress, and I'm also honored and happy that uh, you and me are going to be uh, hosting the first uh, Northwest Mining Daba together. But I know that you are one committed person. Uh, you always pay attention to detail, and and it, it it's really an honor. I know that sometimes you even push me when I lack uh, with things, documentation, and all that. But most importantly, what I love about this program of yours. The proceeds, you always take them to touch a charity. I've seen you buy people school uniform, shoes, sanitary towels, build houses, pay people's fees uh, 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 in tertiary institutions. I've also seen you help our members because I met you through Sapayop. I've also seen you help members who even would attack you after. People that you have helped save their cars, their houses, their families, and you're always quiet about it. But I want you to break it down. Why this involvement and what are you currently working on in terms of your events? Okay. No, thank you. I think firstly I want just to correct one thing. Uh, the masquerade, I didn't steal it from you. We sit down, we strategize, but you focus, decided to go and do Kofifi. I said, okay, go to Kofifi. Let me continue with this side. <laughs> so you did not expect that it would have been a success. Now you say, Astol, you are more than welcome to come back because it was your, your views and initiative, but uh, I mastered it and I presented it. So you are more than welcome. My to come. intellectual property. Prof. Yes, yes. Prof, yes. I was dealt yeah. with by okay. this man. Uh, secondly is the issue of pizza hal. Mm. Uh, Pico production or Pico group. Mm. We had to look onto programs that uh, will be a program that must have significant in the society. Yes. So we then started to think of a few programs and so forth, and we've have realized that, uh, for example, we, we looked, uh, the first one, we tried to award uh, voluntary teachers who are doing well in the society. Those are teachers who, for example, are creating a program where kids are getting up to matric and so forth, and they are either getting stipend or they are not getting a salary. And on top of that, they are not even being appointed as a permanent at work or giving them a chance. Yeah, so right. we had to, to do something that opened the doors for them to be able to be employed, where I can confirm today that all the teachers that were awarded that were voluntarily, today they are permanent on different schools. That is one of the programs that we wanted to see, and it's a program that needs government to be part of it. And also, you know? it's, it's one program that brings the pride and dignity. Yes. The teaching profession design. Correct, Because yes. we have forgotten. It's like teaching, it's like those low and low uh, 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 careers. Careers, yes. Whereas it's actually the foundation, the foundation and the base of someone. To be, yes. Yeah. So now, what is happening is, I don't, know, I don't understand why, for example, the Department of Education is failing to partner with us when we got a the best mechanism of a system that even facilitated to a process that they could see that we are able to identify teachers who are doing very well. Yeah. But that one is something for us to discuss some other time where we'll need the involvement of the department to be presently to tell us why. Yes. Uh, then we also looked onto another program where we saw, <clears throat> for example, in South Africa, we have issues that um, celebrities, especially on the sports career, when they die, there's a problem in terms of funeral. Some of them, after the soccer career is done, you find them, you won't even believe that this one was a star. Mm. Very few have shares somewhere. Very few have maybe something running. The others, you find them, like you won't even believe. You can't compare them even to say this one was a star comparing to stars on other countries, in Europe and etc. So we said no, but... We need to do something. Mm. We need to do something that government can then relook onto that issue and see how can he help such stars who represented this country before. Uh, for example, we said, if we are going to focus on awarding former 
players that represented the flag of South Africa. Mm. Uh, maybe it will bring or open their brains to see that these people are still here. Mm. They, with them, we can still use them to make them a coach. They can become a coach of the school. Where, they, for example, schools are also having uh, scholar sports. They can use them to go there and give them a small amount of salary. We can use some of them to go in terms of scouting in, in the villages or in the society, somewhere there, and get something out of that. Mm. And we can have some of them, for example, to go in terms of preparation and training to play for or, or to become coaches, assistant coach for teams and so forth. So for that to happen, firstly, we needed to bring them back to light. How do we bring them back to light? We bring back them to light by creating a system that we allow people to vote and choose and, and have their views and say, no, for example, uh, I'll give an example of Dr. Kumalo. Uh, in most of our program, we invited Dr. Kumalo. Uh, Dr. Kumalo is someone that by now would have maybe be a coach in overseas or so forth mm -hmm. because of his experience, his look, he, the way he is, he's still the Dr. Kumalo that uh, wants to see the goodness into sports. Yes. You know? Then we have, for example, uh, other uh, coaches as well, uh, other play, former players like uh, uh, Fabian Makati. You know, Fabian Makati, I think now is with uh, MTN 8. But those are people that, for example, we think that they, they play a very critical aspect in, into the society, into the life of the kids, when kids see them. So we then had uh, our opportunity. We then awarded uh, Fabian Makati. is one of the stars of Northwest. He's not only being a star, but on his free time, he goes and tries to, to, to train some kids from Underleg and other places and so forth. So you can see the patient is there, the, the, the spirit and I all see. the things there. I yes. see. I see. We, we, we awarded uh, uh, Nkune. As you, as you know, that he was one of the long-serving goalkeeper. Mm. And he is actually going for his uh, retirement now. Uh, he was very, very excited to receive our award. Mm. And we did not expect that, that he would have even made such a nice statement mm. on his page. And a uh, Chiefs fan, the comment that we got from them in terms of uh, being happy to see that program. Mm. It also showed us that, no, indeed, we are doing something because the changes are there. Uh, Mutsipe, the reality is this. He invests a lot into sports. Yeah. Let us not say he's a player, because I don't know if he ever even scored one goal, but he invests a lot into sports, and he does a lot of things that is creating a system to change people's life through sports. And I can stand here today and say that we are the first guys who stood up and at least award him, not going to ask for sponsorship. Mm. We looked onto the goodness he's doing. In terms of sponsorship, it's for him to decide, does he feel he wants to participate and be part of our program? We will always accept his uh, sponsorship. Yeah. But it doesn't take us away to recognize the good that he does. He's the president of uh, CAF. Uh, I believe it's for us as South Africans to be happy to see the first South African to lead CAF. Mm. He got into CAF, he created changes. The changes that he created there, it even opened doors for us to be seen somewhere. A person like that, we should not just keep quiet because uh, he's a billionaire. Yeah. No, we are also billionaire in brain. Mm. So we can see, we can implement. Mm. We don't need to look on the differences of capital, to be able to say, because the billionaire, he does not deserve. He deserves to be awarded just like any other person in the society. Let's talk by Eco, Eco Bros. Yeah. Is actually a coach after such a long time that brought South Africa to Afcon. We need to be happy about it. Nobody wanted to talk about Bafana Bafana. Mm. Since his participation, there's a lot of changes at Bafana Bafana. But it's not only him. I also want to say thanks to the HOD of Bafana Bafana. And I nearly thought you were going to say thanks to Sundowns. No, 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 no. For no. bringing no. solid. No, 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 no. 
I want to say thanks to the HOD, yeah. David Mulwantwa. His discipline in the team is creating Bafana Bafana to raise the spirit and getting somewhere. So we need to be proud about such. Mm. We should not shy away when they do the right thing. The Desiree Ellis, you know it very well. A very strong female who could go and represent Banyana Banyana eh? came back to South Africa giving hope to all the females in this country mm. that they are capable. You know, there's a lot of other people. Those is the kind of things that we want to look. We don't want to award someone because he's, he's a Pico's friend or because he's Capuchino's friend. We're doing a favor. We don't do favors. We allow the system to run properly and we want to see that happen. But I want to extend my invitation to you and the team to come and check the next award so that it can give you an idea because we are now moving to Africa. Mm. We are intending to award, for example, uh, Drogba. We are intending to award uh, Samuel Eto. Mm. We, are, we are going more into Africa mm. because it's not about us in South Africa. It's about us in Africa. And it's going to be possible because I was just, I wrote a message to Samuel Eto. And then I want him to confirm his timing and so forth. And, and it's, it's going to happen. It's not that it's not going to happen. It's going to happen. Because we want them to come to South Africa and also give a hope to the kids. Mm. To be in a way of saying, if this person could do it, why can't I? So our program is more in terms of how can we change the society? How can we bring life into the society? Going into the issue of um, uh, what we do in, in like, uh, let's say, the, the tour of Sapayopa or the tour of Pico Production, as you said, we use the uh, Sapayopa to, to climb the ladder. No. Maybe you might be wrongly informed. Uh, when I was the president of Sapayopa, we could not only stay with one program. We had to create a program within the program of the club to be able to expand the program for us to be able to actually uh, sell the flag or promote the flag of Sapayopa. Yes, around but the people, remember when you were president, you uh, awarded people. Yes, yes. No, I'll, I'll, come, I'll come to that. You remember you awarded people. I'll come, I'll come and to you that. You never awarded me. Who came up with no, those no, ideas? No, 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 no. I never, there is not a day that I, I did not award it no, unfairly you, you anyone. you gave some Mickey Mouse people awards in that Galadina. Which one? No, le let, me deal, let me deal firstly with the tour. I'll come to the Galadina. The Free State tour? Yes, 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 yes. No, I'll, let me deal Those with that. Those were my ideas. Let me deal with that. Let me deal with that. Because if I don't deal with that, the perception well, of the... I want to apologize. No, 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 no. There's no apology. We need to be factual about the reality of facts. Okay, apologize. Accepted. So, so when I was a president in 2021, ne? what then happened? We could not sit with a program of saying Sapayopa is only having a rally. Number one. Number two, we were actually on that process or the, the coming off from the COVID-19. Pico, let's, 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 I want right. us to talk. Now we are talking... Mm. Bikey. Yes, now we, we, I, 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 I want to answer your question. You're going to fight with me. No, 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 no. no. In my studio. Okay, no problem. Let me allow you then to talk. Pico, initially, when you ascended to the position of power, remember, they came up with this thing that we're going to appoint the president. Who will instead appoint the cabinet? That day, who was contesting you? Must answer you. Yes. You were trying to contest me. Fine. But Before, I beat you. Wait. But wait. I, no, but except for the... Let me talk. I moor you there. No, let me talk. No, just Pico. accept that one. Wait. I you, you came there. to me. <laughs> I got a big... Yes. You said to me, my man, I still remember your words. My man, let me... Give me a chance to run this thing. Remember we said at that shop, give me a chance, don't contest me. I will put you as my deputy president. Am I lying? Can I correct you? I want to correct you without interruption, if you allow me. Number one. Did we have a meeting before no, the election? Let me 
respond to you without interruption. Yo, Pico, don't start today to be a liar. You are not a liar. Let me correct you and respond to you on that. I advise you before we even when there is Producer, please, please uh, turn that lie detector on our cameras because we need to expose this man. No problem. I, I warn you before because you guys were busy meeting Dan Mokopani and teaming up and so forth. I was just relaxed. I said, no, Mokopani are my guys. Because I'm not, my soldiers were ready I'm on the ground. I'm not saying you didn't have numbers. I'm yes. saying, no, did, no, no. Did, did we Wait. not have a gentleman's I, I, agreement? I want to, to respond to you. Did we not have a gentleman's agreement? I want to respond to you. Can I respond to you? Okay. You were going to Mokopani. Those soldiers are mine. The soldiers, they call me, they say, ah, Capatino came here. I said, no, keep him relaxed. I've never been to Mokopani right. for a meeting. We, so. we went to the showground, to, to the racetrack. Arrived there, I found uh, your soldiers are there and trying to fight for you there. When I count them, there were four. I said, this one's going to murder them. There's no problem. And then I called you. I said to you, DJ, let's come together. Yes. No, no, no. That's what I did. I called you. Before even yes. that, I said, let's come together. Yes. Because me and you can run this thing. And, you, you and if we run it together... You know what you said? To no, 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 let me answer you. said you. for the stability let of the you. Let me answer you. Let me answer you. I said, if we run this thing together, we will have the most strongest club in South Africa. Mm -hmm. Because when you are here, I'm here. When I'm there, you are there. We are going to run this thing. That's what we discuss. Mm -hmm. But you are very, 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 very convinced by your <coughs> company manager, TK. <laughs> Mm -mm. No, TK on. was not with you. No, 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 no. TK, remember. I will tell you why I'm saying that. And I'll tell you why I'm saying that. You are very convinced. <laughs> and me, my campaign manager was a simple guy. It was staff only. He said that uh, these guys were going to murder them that day. Don't worry. The murder happened. When we went to Shishiho. Yeah. And that is something that we need to clear with everyone. Our club has a system. What is the system? We like to accept to go to a GM and they don't come. Those who don't come, after decisions are taken, then they want to come and overturn the decisions. And that's where things goes wrong. That's why even you were removed from power. Why? Because we call a AGM. They agreed on the chat. Time oh, of coming no, no, back. No no no. no, 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 no. I want to correct Pico, that. Ju I, no, I, just hold on. I was removed by Sarah. Oh, hold, hold on. And I don't want to even oh, say hold what. Hold on. I'll give you a chance. Yeah. Don't I'll lie. Give, I'll, no, I, I'll give you a chance. And you betrayed me also then. No. No. Fine. Let's talk about Sishiro. Let's talk about not Sishiro. Betrayal, Let's okay? talk about Sishiro. Now, when we went to Sishiro, remember, we needed to have, I think it was 120 members were there at Sishiro. Pico, we are making a, a, no, a, a very uh, short let thing. Me, let very me long. answer you. You are ver making While a very short day, thing very long. You were consulting with your team, and I was just watching, and I came to you. Mm. We even went to buy coke together to the shop. Mm. I said, DJ, don't try this. Let me run with it. And you, and you I'll, bring you, I'll bring you into the team. As a what? No, I said, if it happens, I'll bring you as a vice president. Okay. It, I can confirm that. There's nothing wrong about it. I confirm that. Ne? Yes. All right. Fine. Yes. What do I believe. Leave that. Just hold on. No, no, no. Because no, no, no. my interview studio no. with this one. Let me, let me correct the issue here. So that this one know. is my studio. It's fine. It's your studio. But you cannot come to the studio and try to score I points. I promised us money, Mara. This no, is no, 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 no. You mustn't score points in your studio because your studio. We need to correct things here. Yes. Then what happened? We agreed. But let me tell After you something. We agreed, because, let me tell you where you went wrong. Let me tell you where you went wrong. But let me tell you something. Let me tell you where you I went wrong. I think you're a great leader. Yes. And I think you have the heart for support. Yes. But let me just correct you where yeah. you went wrong. We agreed one thing when we came from the shop. Mm. Eh? When we came back, I said, talk to your people. I went to address No, them. no, no. Just hold on. I said, I said to you. My said, campaign manager. No, just hold on. Nominated. No, 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 no. Just hold on. Just hold on. I said, talk to your people. Because if you don't talk to your people, it's going to become an no, issue. No, Pico, we didn't what didn't happen? Pico, when we, we did, arrived there, Pico, your own campaign manager turns against you, he stand up and he nominated uh, you. Everybody was surprised. Pico didn't 
TK didn't turn against me. He I did. told them, guys, I am not standing. I think Pico is the right guy for the club. I said, what? You have energy. Secondly, you have resources. Right now, I don't think I have enough time and resources. And I think genuinely you want to make a difference. Can we give him a chance? They agreed because they listened to me. No then the, the strategy was did that. They brought you, look, did they brought you to look, my team or not? Look. Did they brought you I, to my I, team I'll or not? I'll come to that, Pico. Okay. Pico, don't lie. I you are you a great team. guy and I want you not to lie. I brought you to my team. Listen, you know I, I you, brought you to my can team. Can I speak? Wait. Yes, 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 okay. Wait, Pico. Okay. Uh, I think you have a short memory. You forgot. Then TK, who's a campaign manager, we decided that he must be the one to nominate you. That will tell everyone that it means things have changed. Then he did it. We all agreed. Okay? Then after you got into power, Pico, you put Mighty. Because Mighty uh, uh, is a rebel rouser. He's a multimillionaire uh, uh, and everything. You thought if you put Mighty there, you are going to actually not have help. Wait, wait, do wait. I, do Pico. I care about other people's money, me? Pico. Uh, no, wait, I'm coming. Ah, man. I'm coming. You know my capacity. Why must I worry about it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't rely on anyone's capacity. I know. I know. I'm a man on my own. Ne, you, the, so, the, so cut off the day of my the, thing. The being people a, you maybe he's a millionaire to you guys, not to me. Sharp. Let's clear, clarify that one day. Yeah. Might, you you, no, mighty, must say, you mighty, must say mighty, to your side. Mighty, say, for me, might is a million. Don't say because he say yourself. Okay, sure. Because for me, might is a, is a biker of Sapayopa and he's like any other biker I'm of Sapayopa. Let's, let's be there. He's not let's an, forget about millions. Fine. Here. He's not an ordinary. I didn't show you my statement as yet. He's not an ordinary. So let us not come to that. Fine. Thank you. Then you, you, you had a cabinet there, remember? Yes. That you put. I called you. Do you remember my speech? No, 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 Pico. Wait, wait, do you remember wait, my speech? I don't remember it. Okay, fine, thank yeah. you. Yeah. Then uh, I called you. I said, my man, I see you have a cabinet there. And our agreement is not out. And I said, no, man, you know, uh, uh, these people are going to give me, I'm going to manage them, don't worry. Uh, what, what? You remember you gave me something? I said, okay, my brother. Work. They all turned against you. It was nonsense. People were writing rubbish about Sapayop on Dideng. Who rescued you? I said, Pico, give me club's account on social media. I took it. I said, tell them you have appointed a PR company from Cape Town. Remember, I dealt with all those fools who were writing nonsense about Sapayop from our club. Remember when I opened, I said, two o'clock, whoever has a question for Sapayop come. I'm a media guy. I'm a media graduate. I have published papers, international journals, on social media. You can't defeat me there. It's my space. I'll fuck you up. I dealt with those morons. All of them who are saying stuff. I still have clips of people who are staying, saying worse stuff about Sapayop. But they actually said me. I said stuff about Sapayop and I wanted to destroy it. I cleaned. There was quiet. I said, fine, now. Now we are coming with toss. I wrote... No, no, no DJ... Let me come in. There. Remember, no, wait, wait, no, wait, no, no, wait, no, no, wait, no, no. Pico. Wait. Are you as admitting you, you, that you, you see, you see, it will be an issue if you do not want to accept the truth, or you don't want to make peace with issues of Sapayop. Let's be clear about that. You need to be. You need firstly to reconcile yourself and make peace. This is the situation. When I took over, I had to sit down and structure the office. But we need to look on terms of continuation. Pico, I think you're a great guy. Yes, yes, yes. Just let me, let me, let me just, let me, I think, just, I think, let me, let me explain. I think you're a great guy, but the, the sooner you and me <laughs> yes. sort out what happened between us, yes. that's the bad. Look, but you know, you know very well, mm. me and you, there is no issues. Nah. The issue is one, we need to accept when you make peace that no, we need to move forward. We move forward. Yeah. We got big business. You, 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 you know what? Sapayop is just our, you know what kills, our time where we go. You know what kills South Africa? Bikes. Yes. Do you know why we have problems in South Africa right yes, now? Yes. It's because white people has never really apologized for what they did to us. No, 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 no. The white people never no, really no, went no, to the extent no, of saying, no, 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 no. we have buried people no, at some farm. No. We have what, what? They I, never done that. I, I want to correct you there. Remember, it's not that uh, we need to understand what needs to happen is to make peace with it. If you make peace, things are going to be fine. 
the white people are not you know making what? peace that blacks must lead. But you know what? They must make peace. We must, when us, me and you, yes. Pico, yes. we must deal with the truth in order to avoid such things to happen yes. in future. Okay. Then, Pico, I saved you. Remember I said, don't tell them. No, but you work with Wait. Them. I said, don't tell them who is your number one support. Yes. Remember? But in fact, I did suspend you as well, ne? because when you, when, you, when you disrespected me on social media, yeah. I remember even that one, then. Uh, no, they, they are shaking remember. you <laughs> a little bit so that you can come to your senses. No, no, no. But uh, yeah. you see, I'll tell you why, I'm, why, why I, said, mm. I said it now. This is the situation. And I accepted your suspension. Yeah, this, this, this is the situation. Look, this man doesn't want us to talk uh, uh, about no, something. No, Sapayopa is something that I want you to understand on the following. Uh, there are people in the club that have capacity. You are one of them. And in most cases, the mistake we make, we are trying to run the club as a political club. Mm. That's what we make. Yeah, and, we have politicians like you okay. who are paying people because to, you see, to you vote see, for them, no, 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 who no. are buying no. members, who are buying no. uh, the whole of Mokopa. Yeah, actually, the, the thing is not about buying members. I'll tell you now. And you will agree Buying with stuff. Me. And you will agree with me that me and you, we saved at ESCO for a very long time. Me and you, we saved at ESCO for a very long time. We are actually candidates, to be honest, that there's histories of the club. Besides those ones who came yesterday, came last week, came last year, came two years back, and they want to save, but we're looking in terms of history of the club. Pico, I'm raising... So, so our point, to, our point, to, let, let, me, let, me now come, let, 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 let me come to this point. Let me come to this point. <laughs> because we saved at ESCO for a long time, and sometimes... It's difficult, for example, I'll even put you an example. If we take any of the new guys today and make them a president to lead you, while you know that this person does not have the history of the club, you are not going to accept it. Especially when we... No, no, I accept. I, no, I accepted, you know, you know why I'm saying you I accepted accept the nonsense you, you know, you know why, you know why I'm, I'll that say you that had last year. No, no, no. I'll say, you know why I'll say that you won't, won't accept it. Mm. If you'd have accept, you'd have allowed... The program that has been put together last year. Didn't I allow it? No, 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 no. You are saying now is nonsense. Hey, I said just I now, just now you yes, said. Yes, but I said that means you, you did not. Let allow me tell you something. I said I allowed the nonsense. I took no, 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 no. I never took this is strategy. First thing, this is strategy. Pico, I'm a big over here. We're going to have a problem with me. Okay. Because okay. you don't want me to deal with the truth. You are actually making me to move off the tangent. No, 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 no. no. Here we where I was going. Okay. Here we are dealing here with the old yeah. reality yeah. and how it must be done. Pico, let me tell you something. Yes. Where I have a problem with you. Okay. As a leader of Sapayop. My brother, I served you. It's true. As a leader. I never denied it. And even when the club was insulting you. Yes. After you spent your own money. Yes. You brought us Kaspar Novest. Yes. During COVID. Yes. When there was nothing. Sound stage you paid. Yes. Artists you paid. From your own pocket. Pico. You spent close to 700,000 rents. I was there, I watched it. You worked with me from the beginning. Yes, I worked with you from the beginning. Wait. In fact, I said even thank Wait. you because you are the one who ran the program from the inception of the tour. Yes. Yes. I understand that. I was working with you. Gave you an idea. If you don't like it, you'll tell me, no, this won't work. Yes. This can work. Some you'll even, when I give you a half idea, you'll put more uh, beef on it. Yes. That's something I like about you. We worked, I was loyal to you. Because even when we had the AGM in Middleburg, yes. I was on your call to a point where I nearly military tortured one of the members yes. with my own hands. Because you knew the truth. Yeah, because I knew the truth and yes. I knew what you went yes. through. You see, then uh, because of the insults, and I think it was even causing problems with your yes. family. It, it was. You, you it, not, not it was. It, it, it did cause... Any, uh, you resigned. Yes. You remember? Yes. You resigned. Yes. So I want to tell you where I have a problem with you. Okay. Came the AGM. Ne? You know I'm standing. You raise your hand to contest me. No, DJ. Now I want to correct something for to you. You are a leader. I believe you are a leader because you got capacity of a leader. How do you resign from a position no, 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 and no, no, contest no, no, it no. again? I want to, to make you understand. You are a leader. You have the capacity. And we all know you have a capacity of a leader. 
Those are just a pass by thing. You should never take such things into mind. For the following reasons. If you look well in terms of my resignation, and I will, I'm here free and open to say it, I said, I want peace for the club. Mm. And I want us to resolve things to give everyone a peace of mind. Remember I wrote it. You, yes. you told me what yes. you want. Yes. I wrote yeah. it. But I said, I want a peace of mind and I want everybody to be at ease. Mm. Why? Because allegations come this side of one man show, I'm a dictator, and this and that. Mm. So definitely if you are a leader and you know that you got no fear of anything, you need to go and give the people an opportunity. Mm. Ne? Mm. For them to be able to do and present whatever they want to present. Mm. Therefore, I said, for the sake of the club and for the peace and for us to be able to unite, if I'm the cause, let me resign. Mm. Regardless the issue and the problem of my family. Because if it was not that, it would have then, we would have not understand the views of the club and what we're going for. For example, I then resign for one reason, for us to be able to unite and for us to be able to have a way forward. You became the president. The same people that we thought that the issue is me, they were fighting you. Mm. The same people, because for me it was the issue of saying, ah, dictator, this one, whatever, hey, we didn't vote for him, while they were there. Mm. Hey, the decisions and this and whatever. So what did we do? We said, well, for the sake of peace, because we can't divide the club. Mm. We must keep it together. Ne? Let me resign. I resign. You came in as a president. When you came in as a president, the same people, the same people today and yesterday, and when you were saving, they did not even want it to come and unite the club. Because when you were running the club, when you were the president, the club was not united. As much mm. as you tried to unite, even you created... A charity, I remember you did even, you even brought a good program with coffee. Where coffee was giving us big artists under the umbrella of Sapayopa. Mm. The same people were pushing for, you, for your downfall. Mm. The same people were pushing for your downfall. Mm. You organized a, a very wonderful rally. Mm. The same people that you trusted in your own office, mm. that would have helped you to be able to unite and make sure that we have continuity. Mm. What happened? Yeah. So what I'm trying to say is this. Our club, for us to fix the club, even now we got a, a problem now, you know it, in terms of saying that no, we are going to the AGM and this and whatsoever, reports and everything. It will still not solve the problem of the club. Mm. What needs to happen? We need to create a plan. We need to create a strategy. The strategy might not be liked by everybody. The strategy might not work for everyone, but for the sake of the club. We need to come up with a plan where we need now to, to do and put things on a stability state. Mm. Let's forget about money. Let's forget about this one have that. Let's forget about this one is this and, and whatsoever. Why? Because we are now trying to use the club to come and show off. Mm. Okay, and that is what we must not do, because Pico is coming to the club to come and say that no, Pico bought a new car, the man with seven wallets. Kana, what did you call yourself? Uh, three wallets. Three wallets. Yes. Yeah. You see, so now it's not about us getting into our bikes and ride and represent the club. Mm. It's about now Pico is going to buy drinks for all of us, or Mighty is gonna come and buy uh, bottles. Oh, Makapa is going to come and slaughter oh, a cow. Someone is going to pour oh, petrol for you people. You understand? That is not actually what the club was formed for. Mm. We, are, we are deviating from no, that Pico. and we're creating a problem. So now, what Pico. I'm trying to say, Pico. what I'm trying to say, no, we, we, no, we are jumping take, into, let me get, let me get jumping done. into solutions before yes, we yes, deal yes. with the truth. Yes, yes, but the thing is this, what we need to get done is this. Mm. Remember, uh, when you are a president and I can come with any brilliant idea, mm. The face is you who needs to implement it. Mm. How it's been given, how it's not been given. You are the face to implement it. Mm. If we implement it wrong, it doesn't mean that you betrayed me. 
you did it you did not implement it appropriately because of maybe the lack of knowledge Mm. So those are the kind of things that we need to look around. Good. You see? But people, so, I want so, us to so, deal so, with so let things. us make peace. Let I us, want let us deal make with peace. Let us, let, let us make peace. For me, if for, you for feel, me, you if peace. you feel, if you feel that indeed that no, you were supposed to be the vice president and it did not work out, you end up becoming the president. So mm. it's it's actually a coin into your side. You were part of my team. People mm. did not know. I, But I, you were part of my team. I was your team. Who, no, you were part of my team mm. who made sure that the 2021 rally and the events and the programs of the club became success. You never mentioned me in your gala dinner, Biko. You were instant. Okay. I want my, my gala dinner, the, the, the gala dinner of 2021. Yeah. 20, but, but you know what I mean? Tell me, tell me 2021. No, no, no. Let's deal with it. I'm talking about 2021. 2021. When I had COVID. 2021, no. no. When I had COVID. Just hold on. Let, let me answer this. The Simas Arab. Who, who was I, I awarded in 2021? Remember the Simas Arab. Yes, but who was I awarded in 2021? No, but on your presidential speech, you mentioned people that you appreciated. I appreciated you. No, I was there. I you remember my team. Nico, I came there so many no, no, no. You mentioned them. I will show you the video. Can I send you the video? I have it. You have it. Send it. I have it. Please go and listen to it properly. No, no, I listened. I'm a good listener. I, I want to tell you something so that you must know. Can you have both both boxing gloves? Yeah. I think this thing is beyond you. Me, 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 me. I want you to understand something. I'm a leader who acknowledges people. People are a great guy. Yes. And no, but I want to make. Can you? I want to make it clear. Can you go and to no, answer? Give me a chance. I just want to clarify because you said in my the, my time of presidency I did not award you. So I want us to clarify that because I don't want it to be coming out wrongly. When I was a president, I gave an award to presidents and vice presidents. That's what I gave. Mm. And all the presidents, even when you were president, no, 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 And not only from South Europe, we even got some other visitors that I acknowledge them. You were there, okay? I acknowledge my team. Yes, you did. I do not mention each one by name because you knew the dynamic of what was happening there. But I did. Even in the report, it's there. So definitely, I don't want to to be uh, quoted and compare on the last year's event mm. because remember, the last year's event, I was actually. Supposed to be full time or participation in that event, but there was a issue in between because why? Uh, it seems like some members does not understand the programs of the club. Let me give direction. Yes. To our discussion. Yes. This is between you and me. Fine. Sapayop is there. Yes. That's how we met. I mean, it's not a secret. I met you yes. through Sapayop. We did other things outside, but I met you through Sapayop. Correct. Then you became president. You resigned. We go to the AGM. You contest me. Wait, Pico. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I must contest you. You can't go undefeated. Yeah. Who said you must go undefeated? And then, um, huh? I got elected. Yes. I don't want to talk about the margin and stuff because it's bad. But uh, I beat you also on the margin. You know it. You were knockout. Let's be. Wait. If you want to talk about the margin, 2021, I beat you. No, no, no. I didn't contest. No. no. You were nominated. You were undefeated. You were defeated there. I didn't contest. No, DJ. You see, there's, there's, you're if, contradicting yourself. As long as you accept, uh, when you lose, then you have good to move. You're, you're contradicting yourself. Okay. It's you, fine. you, you were. We were elected unopposed. So you accepted. You were elected unopposed. No, first, first, let's agree. I was elected unopposed. You agree with it? Yes. There was no problem. No problem. You were standing for that. Yes, and then I let. Now let's I let everyone that was 2021. Everyone who took to your cabinet yes. who turns against you. Yes. I came to save you. Yes. But I was saving the club. Yes. It was not even about you. Okay. I like you. Uh, and I was not happy with you. And, and, and just to, before before you even continue I want to say thank you to you in terms of your closing report where you confirmed last mm. time there that when Pico left office he left 100,000. Mm. I'm I'm so grateful about that. Why? Because yeah, you, you gave us your yes. family man. Yeah. Yeah, but because that actually showed the 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 the, the That's the, how you love the club. You spent 800,000 for the, the honesty club. about that confirming that indeed there was fans because you, why? You, because people, people gave us 800,000. Yeah, people were trying to portray 
uh, that when, when you took office there was no man you gave us 800000 rand no problem there yeah we can that continue with it one day yeah i yes. think i don't know what's the reasoning behind that you yes. only know it yes. then after i mercilessly troubled you which i was not happy to see a man i respect to lose with such a magic <laughs> and, and i got into power <laughs> yes. and i said pico i still remember that time you even said you don't want to be involved with anything i said pico please support me yes i'm going to need your support you said no i don't want to do anything with biking and throughout my leadership pico you've never supported me are you sure No but I know that you are angry at lap not appreciating No 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 no, no, no. Remember, 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 can I speak my, 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 yes, yes. can I speak and yes, give it a okay, history okay no problem and I led um comes a a a a a general let me I will tell you why other members resigned they resigned after we had a meeting as a scope of the report ne which are in your cabinet in my cabinet okay those other three that resigned they resigned because i said we are not taking supply opus money because there's no money that's the reason they resigned because there's no money i'm going to say it uh we were convinced me and the vice president majos to meet a uh, uh, one of the nine founders which is sarel we were supposed to meet with jos but jos didn't make it and also in that particular meeting and i said there is no money for bakhalar this year and that's when i started to have a problem with sarel and remember i'm the one instrumental to remove him in power this is the truth that's what happened to me what he did is what he removed me from the whatsapp chat while you are watching my friend my competent after removing that what did he do circulated and said we are constituting another leadership spread lies as he's a liar he has survived with lying i'm not afraid of him i tell him even on his face i always wrote about it he lied but he then what made presidents which is foreign which is not even in our constitution he violated the constitution while some people who are my friends are watching and you know what was the step on my back is when you accept to be part of the presidents that were put there to deal with me to list my lies were said and you know what i told myself i am going to wait for the guys to work so that they realize that what they were lying about the things that they said about me is very because people when they come to power they don't know what's happening in leadership especially organizing the rally it went so the beef i'm a, a chewing with you right now is that I never expected that you'll also be part of the leaders but also I thought maybe you are there to address the problems because of the 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 thingy the constitution is violated by someone who has personal hatred it has nothing to do with cappuccino like with a club it's with cappuccino dealing with removing with this guy then I said you know what I've got a lot of problems to worry about a club that's when I even got injured my hand and i said let me focus on healing i'm not going to do anything i left then there were presidents big shoulders running around i'm president i'm president i think even at some point you left them to watch what they are doing and that is the center of the problem minangiti wenze nu kapachin because it's something that we must discuss the where i must lay the truth that we were asked for money that is not there then we became the enemy and we were dealt with and the idea was to embarrass me they said there's 800,000 rands taken from where because if there's 800,000 rands it means there was the, it means last year there's 1.6 that also disappeared because of the crowd was even bigger than mine you understand but that is another thing but pico okay my point this, wait this this is my my thing my point with you i i will want you to allow me to answer you, you are coming i'm i'm wrapping up and when i answer you please do not this, this, this yeah thing. yeah i'm wrapping up here okay on the issue of that my betrayal was when you even accept to be one of these mambo jambo leaders who are dealing with me because i'm the last constitutionally elected president in fact i'm still the president is that like i no longer want to lead that club uh, i want i wish we can have a young 
guy in his 20s who can take that club somewhere. Us old dogs, like you and me, advice from the background. You understand? Because what is happening now, and even people from outside can see what's happening now. But we know that also another problem is this uh, uh, miscreating, uh, 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 changing history. For instance, people, I think the, the, the money that is left in Sapayop must be used to take people to psychiatry because they have a schizophrenic. People who believe Bu was not our first president. Even last year, people, when we were awarded, you awarded all the previous president. Remember, the program was there to humiliate me. When I learned about it, I came to the gala dinner. I was not recognized as the previous president of Sapayop. And I asked you, and you said, my man, I'm not part of this. Then I said, no, no, it's fine. Even when you won that small trophy, I came to congratulate you because I know that you have the heart for the club. You work for the club. But for someone to say, I've never led the club or a president is somebody who needs psychiatric help. It has happened. You can't change history. You can't change the fact that Zbu led this club. Wahafa, on the problem. Because the history has been a, we went, we rode to Switzerland, we decided to form a club and I'm president. You don't want to mention the anchor, the person who was even financially liberated to even oil some of the machinery of the club. You understand? So, but to come back again is that I felt <clears throat> betrayed by you on those points, my friend. And I, it hurt me. You understand? It hurt me because that is a betrayal that hurts more if it's coming from someone you think you're close to. Okay. Apology accepted. Okay. Can I, can I, I did listen to you. Sharp. Sure. I'll respond to you. Now I won't respond to you as Pico. I'll respond to you as a member of the club. Yeah. And I want you to take note. This is the following. I said it before. Sapayopa is a very great club. Mm. In fact, is a club with a lot of potential. But members, some members in the club does not understand the potential and the capacity of Sapayopa. Mm. We have a lot of people, for example, who join us for the sake of seeing Sapayopa is big without understanding Sapayopa itself. One of the things that I want you to understand and make peace is this. Founders of the club, or whoever founded it, or whoever started it, or whoever did not start it, it will always be there. You are starting this program of this studio today. Mm. Tomorrow your child can be here. Mm. Tomorrow somebody can come here. Some other people will want to try to remove you, mm. but it will be within you to say, yes, I can be removed, or I will want to maintain. Because why? Mm. It's your grandchild. But I will no, no, never... No, no. I, 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 fine, I, I, but I, I will not, never I omit... You. I, I will never know. omit that I, I worked know. with... Just, 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 hold just, hold just, just hold on. Just hold on. I will never admit that I worked with say, DJ, and it, it will be difficult for, for me to be able to answer you when you want to cut me. Okay, sure. And when you talk, Apologies. I listen to you. Apologies. Now I'm talking as a member of the club. Sure. Not as... A outsider as a member of the club. Sure. Okay. You need to accept mm. the founding of this club mm. in terms of giving the name Isarol. Because mm. that's where your issue mostly is. No, 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 no. I don't have no, an no, issue no, with no, that. No, 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 no. Allow me now to say. I don't have an issue with that. It's fine. No yeah. problem. I, Pico. I spoke to each and every one. Mm. And I want even to put it to you that in our club, possibilities, we might be maybe two or three or four guys that had the opportunity to speak to everyone that participated in terms of funding, yeah. founding of this club. Yes. I spoke to Sbu, I spoke to Spunk, mm. I spoke to Paulina, I spoke to Simen, mm. I spoke to Malaji. I spoke to... By the way, we shot an episode with Zbu, ne? Uh, yeah. yeah. I spoke yeah. To, he, spoke, he spoke about the yes, yes. I, 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 yeah. I can tell you, I spoke to Malaji, I spoke to... Spunk. 
No, Spanga, I spoke to him, I told you already, I spoke to Spanga, I spoke to Malaji, I spoke to Sbo, I spoke to Sarul, I spoke to Jaws. You speak to that lady, Parkerman? Paulina. Paulina. Yes. You speak to that other lady who the lodge in Talmud? My man, everyone... Yeah. So you spoke to all founders? All of them. Vito, you spoke, spoke to Vito? Them. No, Vito is not a funding member. I am just asking. Did no, you speak not, to Vito? Vito is not a funding member. Yeah. Vito was riding with them. He's not a funding founding member. Okay. Remember, I, I didn't I say that. Be, I can be on the radio, mm. but it doesn't mean I'm the one who, fund, uh, who founded this program. Mm. But I can be the first guys on radio, mm. but it doesn't mean I'm the one who founded this program. So we need to clarify those things. Mm. Okay. Now, this is the situation. The logo of Sapayopa. Jaws. It was designed by Jaws. Yeah. Jaws came with an idea. There's a young boy who drew that logo. Mm. That one was, was actually the second decision logo. The one that is now back is the second decision logo. Mm. It was designed by another boy. And then he gave it to Jaws. And then he looked at that. And then Jaws came and then they put it on. Mm. Eh? The name of Sapayopa Sarel. came from Sarel. Mm. The time when the name started, they were attending a rally in Pretoria. It was a white event. And then they asked them, what is the name of your club? Because these guys by then were coming from tropical bikers. It's a breakaway from tropical bikers because the tropical bikers, they did not agree in terms of the program of that time. And then is when they started. Sbu was taught how to ride by Sarol. Sbu was a recommendation by, I think it's Tabo from Desperado by that time, who called Tabo at uh, Tropical Bikers to say, I've got a brother of mine there, he wants to join a club because he can't join there in Desperado. What is it? And then Tabo is the one who called Sarol to assist a Sbu who taught him how to ride. The history is there. I don't want to go and touch much in the history. Yes, there were some issues in between because when, even when they formed this club, the first president of this club was Bo. There was no vote. They were sitting there by the, by the, uh, what, by the racetrack, and then that is how they formulated themselves. It was before the time of uh, the, the launch of the club, and so forth. The first jacket that was done was done in Gauteng, and it was Sarol's jacket. The other ones, even they were having just a pin. So, uh, Joe's by that time used to own a restaurant here by this Shell garage where today's Shell there, uh, opposite, um, uh, I think it was a Holiday Inn or so, whatsoever, the tro uh, what, Protea, whatever, he used to own a restaurant there. So the history is there. Many people don't even know that. The first registration of the club, it was a uh, Sapayopa MC, not CC. Okay? The, that, uh, that registration, the people were there when it was registered, it was Sarol, it was uh, uh, Simen, it was Polina, it was Peter, Malaji, it was Punk, it was Boo. Pico, we're wasting no, time. No, no, I no, think no. you have I already to, mentioned the, 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 the founders. I want, no, I, I, yeah. allow me to, to clarify. You issues. have already okay. mentioned the founders. So, so now, uh, we, we are agreeing. You and yeah, you are agreeing on that one. Okay, fine. Yeah, all of, we are number, two, number two, mm. let's go on that issue. Uh, 2021. I was the president. Mm. Even last year? Yeah, even last year. Even this year. You are still president? Yes. Yeah, we are still president. What, 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 is, what is the issue there? Remember, I consulted and spoke to you in many occasions. It was me, it was you, it was Makapa. Mm. And we always said and had one vision. That and that, that, that's one unsung hero, honestly. Yes. Makapa is yeah, one guy... Yeah. Who's working for this club? No, let me, let, 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 now, let me just say it. Ne? We had many meetings, the three of us, and we said, look, this brand mm. is big. People don't understand this brand. Mm. And we can't let this brand just fall because of sake of people who join us because they got their own intentions without understanding what is this brand. We tried in all means to be able to bring the brand back. We tried, in all means, to bring the brand back. But people who are not participants, they are only participants at the time of coming to fight on the, the chat. That is what creates problems for this brand. Mm. That we discuss about it. And that is even continuing even now. People who don't write, they just come to make noise, you don't see them anyway. 
For example, I came to a point of saying, I'm always riding all the way to Angola, to wherever, Zambia, Zimbabwe, whatsoever. Still, people does not appreciate that. Mm. One of the reasons why Les Boogie is very quiet mm. is not because he doesn't love the club. Mm. It's not because he was not the president of the club. Mm. It's because maybe he feels that, you know what, sometimes let me not try to put effort and energy somewhere where people are not appreciating. No, uh, Pico. No, no, I, I, I did allow you. So allow me to respond. Yeah, but Akira, I still need to direct this according no to what the director yes. is saying. The, the director number, says number two, you're wasting time. No, no, me. No, number two, number two is uh, the issue of you saying that, no, you, uh, the, the, the formation of the club currently is unconstitutional. I want to correct you that it's not. No, and I, I'll tell you why. I think then. I'll tell you why. No, I, 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 I think they English more do you and I little bit. No, 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 no. Let me, let me say that. You say, you, you, you say, Can you say, you say, African Prat. You can, as if you Okay, speak, because yeah. I think you will. Well, I think well, I will well, what, what I'm saying to you is this. There was an explanation. I don't know if you were by the chat by the time. No, they removed me because of. Okay, no problem. They didn't want my voice. Fine. No problem. You were not in the chat. So now yeah. I'll tell you that. They no, I don't want to, to know. I don't want to know no, things because, that happen. No, because you there. know what? It looks bad when you talk about the club and say this and this is what happened and so forth. We need to clarify that. Was I not removed? No, you were removed. Is it wrong for me to say? Why were you removed? Eh? Why were you removed? It's because of I wrote a did, statement. Did you, as did, president? Yes. To clarify what is in the media. It's fine. Uh, we'll come back to that. Things went to the you media see, without me knowing. You see, president. DJ, this is the situation. You spoke. We listen. No, no but we, don't lie. And I said, where is the lie? Don't lie. Where is the lie? You are saying me, I don't want you to said, you said, you, you said we were removed from the chat. Yes. Where is the lie? And I said, there was a statement that was put in the chat in terms of the way the program is going to happen. In everyone in the chat, or let's say 80% of the guys in the chat, agreed with it before creating any formation of any president of region. Because you might not be I, aware. I, I, I want to direct my no, program because of now, we, we are now even moving towards the time. No, no, no. Because is the, the, it's my, my point is that because say, no matter how you lie, what happened to no me, lie here. What, happened to me what happened to me, it's unfair. And for a person like you, you see, to accept the position it, of leadership, the way I was there. I remember, I was voted. I was, and voted and I was voted to run uh, a Northwest. I think each region has been given an opportunity. I think you are power. Right? Yeah, no, no. Each leader has been given, or oh, each region has been given an opportunity to choose or vote for their own president. Mm. They voted me. I never said vote for me. It was their choice. They voted me. Uh, a staff because was voted by his region. Uh, Easy K was voted by his region. Uh, Bra Ali was voted for his region. Uh, I think uh, Shangarai was still acting because he said he's going to leave the country. And then uh, I don't know further than that how did they finalize. He was supposed to leave the country. Uh, yeah, he said he, he will act until he leaves the country. To uh, I don't know, he was supposed to go and work somewhere. But I don't want to go into those dynamics right now, please. I just want to clarify that one day. Oh, Shandara was supposed yeah. to leave the country. Because you, you, you might not be aware of what was in there because you were removed from the chat. Yeah, I was removed by the yeah, so, so that is what happened. It's not that people were imposed. Elections took place. And the effects are there. Now, but now in terms listen, of the constitution, Pico, we agreed. We Pico, agreed. No, let Pico, me talk about the constitution. We Pico, agreed that the constitution was Pico, supposed then to be Pico, come and we were wait, supposed to work I'm on I'm going to give direction to this. Yes. The constitution says it clearly. Wait. Yes. Says it clearly how amendments must be made. And those amendments were not made according to the constitution. Finish and clear. How many constitutions is supported by having? We have one constitution that we adopted the proper one that we, we had. were not having a constitution before. We had, but we adopted. Didn't we adopt, didn't we change the constitution? At the AGM where we met. No, but uh, that's what I'm asking you. We had a constitution? We met and changed it. No, but before, just listen to what I'm saying. We had a constitution. Yes. And then we agreed that we are going to amend the constitution. We then met, we went to meet. We changed it at the AGM. Yes. So now, this is the same thing what is happening now. Formation has been done. We are going to amend the constitution. No, because we, we never. To, we, we remember the different. We never thing. had a chance until today. Yeah, you, 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 know, you know it very Let me tell you what's a different thing. Yes, my man. The different thing is that uh, the constitution was adopted and things were implemented after. 
not the other way around. Any any organized institution should work like that. If you are working like that in your organ organization, I think you are doing things wrong. No, DJ, we yeah. said that's what I'm saying to you. Yeah. You were not in But let me tell you, you something. You see what's happening? Mm? It will be difficult Wait. for you to understand to not to understand why because you are not in the chart. In the chart has been very clearly explained. Guys, uh, pick up. This and this and this is what's going to pick happen. Uh, let's leave that. Uh, yes. uh, 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 let's leave that. I mean you after the Angola ride, when you paid for Sarel, you told me you paid no, for Sarel him. No, Sarel paid for himself. No, but you told me you paid for him. No, for no, 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 no. Sarel paid for him. But oh, you changed him because we are on. Sarel paid but for himself. But you said you paid. You said he didn't have money. No, no, no. Sarel paid for himself. Pico, but you said he didn't no, have money. I never, I never told okay, you that. Fine. I never told you that. Okay, fine. You can I never told you that. Yeah, I know yes. that he's your man, and no. I know that man. You are my man. I respect him a lot. But you are my man. Don't you know that you are my man? Yeah, but you are. Sarel is also my man. No, you are abandoned. Jose is also my man. No, you are abandoned. Pico is my man. Pico, I'm not your man. You are my man. No, no, no. DJ, you are my man. Fine. Not because now you are oh, because hey, we are fighting. Guys. Because now you, you are on radio, you are not my man. I'm not you your see man. Now. Uh, if I was your man, I'm I will, mean, I will not going to get to Angola menu. If, if, if I was your man, I will not go to Angola menu. No, no, I can't go with you and Zarel. Why did you ask me to ask those people to give you slots? I don't, I don't want slot. to come back here having uh, problems. Uh, why, uh, what's going to happen to your slot that you asked me to ask them there? Where? In Angola. I didn't want any slot. Oh, you said you're hey, Talk to these guys. I want to, to have a slot. No, that's, that's me good. coming to DJ. That's uh, what I'm trying to say. Yeah. So, so now when you say I'm, I'm not available, available. Uh, 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 I'm not available anymore. Oh, okay. I'll tell oh, them. I'm very busy here. Uh, I'm busy then? with Northwest Mining in Dub. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm busy with Northwest Mining in Dub. <laughs> but, but, but we're gonna be in Angola together. No, Just no, three days. Not coming there. <laughs> no, no. I'll be busy. Pico. Yes. Let's talk about uh, Northwest Mining in Dub. Yes. And leave uh, this Sapeo. thing of Sapeo. But also, no, but, no, but, 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 but before, before, before we go there, no, but before we even leave Sapeo, I think it's very important that we need to, to also conscious members to say that look, uh, we are not fighting about Sapeo. Mm. We are just talking about uh, small issues of whatever happened in our club. We want things to be right. Yes. Let me tell you something. Yes, but but, not, but, not, but, but if, if we don't really put it into proper perspective, people mm. might understand it wrong. Pico. But the fact of the matter remains one. Our club needs to come together. Pico, there's positive things yes. that I noted yes. about this whole thing that you guys did of having presidents. No, Net? but, but Wait. white clubs do that. Wait, wait. White clubs do that. No. Wait, you, you told me you, you don't Make like whites is it. that much. You told me you don't like whites that much. Yes. Uh, let me tell you something. There are some things that I got there, but also there's some negatives that yes. we got. You understand? And uh, 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 they're called there. I think... You could have had one or two or three people that were really, really, really wrong for that position. That made that arrangement to be bad. In all honesty. There are people who went overboard, who wanted to settle scores, who wanted to do this. And even at the end of the day, some of us ended up even helping. We were told we are sabotaging, including you. They said you are sabotaging them. Remember? From the department, you are making it sure that the dependents are not. I'm the one who brought all the sponsors at Sapayopa. I understand it. I understand. It's not a secret. Since you came to Sapayopa, you've yes. been assisting. Yes. With your own money and also even organizing yes, it's things not for the club. Yes. They said that, which was a lie. I know that. Uh, uh, but you know, when they are not capable, they'll look for a lie. It's no, that, that, that's, that's what I've seen. It's fine. So uh, that's why you mustn't worry about it. They're getting that from their uh, uh, father of lies. <laughs> Anyway, they are getting that from their father of lies. So because of their incompetence, they, I'll tell you that the reason people didn't want to bring me back in chat is because they know that no one can face me when I put the truth. You know what I like about myself? I don't fight with lies, people. I've never fought with lies. No, but DJ, I think you must correct one thing. It should not be about you. It should yes. be about the club. Yes, but now I'm saying yes. we want the club to go somewhere. Yes. And I wish... For the club, young people, yes, capable can come out. I wish people, uh, 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 you know, the problem in Sapapa is what? It's members of members. Yes, you join the club to become a member of someone, and it's going to bite us. If we're not careful, we're gonna cut politics very soon. Yeah, if we, if we're not the careful in the club, is yeah, I'm telling you, if we're not careful, yeah. members of members are going to kill this club completely. This we are on the verge of it. I see. No, this club won't die. Yeah. No, but if we allow it. Yes, that's why you as a member and me as a member, we mm. mustn't allow it. Not only because of a member. As a former president and a former president, we should not allow that. No. Uh, it should not be about you lead now, things must die, I lead, things must die. No, 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 no. no. We uh, must uh, safeguard uh, it uh, and uh, make uh, sure uh, we push for somebody uh, as well. 
The Muslim leaders. A person like me allowed yes. people to lead. Yes. And I never. No, no, you, you didn't allow because you already you just now you said that uh, the way of the issues and so forth. Because that means you need to make peace with it first. No, I it. allow because you know, I will even say people, right now as you're speaking, I, I, I will even put it to you like this. Do I will put it to you like this? Do we, the rally was organized. Do we have to rally, go? rally was not organized. I was not part of the organizing of the rally. Ne? Yeah, you don't come and fight these guys because no, you boycotted. No, 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 I didn't boycott. Why did I boycott? You never helped. No, remember I was. Going, you wanted them to fail. No, I was going for my voting. That's why today I'm the provincial secretary. Oh. So I can't leave. I can't leave. In my mind, I, can't leave. Leave. I was like, people have skills. I came, I came here to attend the gala dinner. Mm. Mm. And then the next, the same night, I drove back because it was our elections. Yeah. And I had to attend the election because today I'm a treasurer of the province because I was there. Yeah, fine. Uh, if I would have been at Sapa Europa, mm. maybe by now I would have just been a member of the branch. Oh, okay. Yes. But all I'm saying is that even prior to that, you stopped helping. Yes, I took a decision to stop helping on the following, and you know very well. Yeah, yeah. No, no, I know. I'm grateful. Then there, there are other people against. Best. No, no. Yeah. Not about personal. Mm. I tried my best, and they said to me, I must sit aside, and I sit aside. Yeah. Why? Because if I would have forced to, to when they say sit aside, I would have forced, it would have looked like I'm hiding something, and I don't want to give them access. But I gave them the freedom. But that's why I said there was always this thing here. Hey, former leaders are, are, are sabotaging us. You remember? You know that's a lie. Yeah. Who brought Musakis? You did it. For how much? Zero cent. For free? Yes. Because of the club? It's not about me. Yes. I saw an opportunity and I negotiated with you guys with what they're doing. And I realized that he's the biggest brand we can put there. It was about the club. It has nothing to do. I forgot whoever said bad things about me. But, but I was told that you also on the same day hosted an event here at Miropa. No, I didn't have an event. No, but that's the story now. Well, at me, the Europa was full because, uh, but I think also I saw you posting it anyway. I was DJing. Yeah, but I saw it. So I, I, I was DJing. Yes, but you know that you are a brand. Yes, you know that you are a brand by uh, being fascinated from from that and as a former I president. I was DJing. You misled the club. You misled the, club. You misled the members. It, it was a Duke. Yes. A, a, a thing of Ringo. It was a completely different yeah, matter. I'm saying now. Yeah. Because your poster is there. Mm -hmm. And members said you actually sabotaged them. No. no, 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 no. I said, listen, I'm not going to deal with yeah, yeah, I confronted you. I'm not going to deal with going to deal with narrow minded. Yeah, but I confronted you. I'm a guy who is potentially yeah. having four yeah. master's degrees. Yes, but I said. So I can't be. Yes, but I can't be. Uh, uh, I can't be. Uh, and members does not even know that I confronted you to say this. I, I, I can't be narrow. You are making yourself to look good now. No, no, no. I, I can't, can't be narrowing my. Confronted you. I can't be narrowing my uh, multiple masters mind with a welder. You understand? No, no, no. I think that you are wrong, DJ. You understand, my brother? No, no, no. You I, know, I, you know why you are wrong. Mm. Uh, your masters, we all respect that, even your doctorate. Mm. But you should not compare now in terms of the field of the others. No, 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 uh, no, no. You are, a, you are a, 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 a plumber. You are a doctor. Be, so you must allow be, others. Be, before Maybe you interrupt financially, me. they could not go as far. Before you interrupt me, should not be, bring the team. Before you interrupt me, I'll yes. tell you about a welder, a plumber, <laughs> a, a, a gardener. <laughs> before you interrupt me, yeah, and, 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 and a street hawker. You mustn't do that. You mustn't do that. No, 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 no. no. Oh, yeah. uh, you, are, you are a doctor. We all know. No, no, not everyone can become what I am. No, but I know. But at least remember. Some of them, they, they do have financial issues. There's some financial issues. Yeah, some of them, yeah, that's, that's their, brain, their brain does not allow them. There's any sauce here. No, but their brain does not allow them. Don't tell me that it's a tech for our news. So their brain does not allow them. Yeah, yeah, the brain. Yeah. Yeah. Let me put it. This is what I'm trying to say. So, <laughs> let us know how it did that. I'm just saying it's a narrow-minded thing. Yeah. Uh, Miropa, gender lifestyle, it's managed or, or owned by Chief Tidiela. That is known. Chief Tidiela asked me, are you playing on Saturday of that e uh, uh, that event? Remember, after Sa 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 Sapa cancelled, they started to conceptualize their own event. They asked me, are you playing uh, anyway? I said, no, I am not. I heard that I'm not needed at Sapa. But remember, even you, the Northwest event, Yes. you told me yes. you are not allowed to book me. No, 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 I didn't say you are not, I'm not allowed. I was very clear to you. I said, 
we had a, a meeting, decision has been taken. Mm. I never said you're not allowed. Yeah. Me and a leader who leads, not being told what to lead. Yeah, I, I, I'm glad to you say you already paid me. No, 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 no but I'm saying I lead according to my capacity. Mm. Actually, in fact, I forgot something. You talk about the issue of betray. DJ, 2021, you actually betrayed me. No, no, no. You know what you did? Because you did. No, 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 no. We are trying to rap here. You tried to make uh, the event fail by organizing a, a vintage yeah. event in, 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 in with a, a DMK's place and then DMK himself said to me, ah, man, and that event day, I told those guys I'm going to survive up. <laughs> no, PJ, you said to me to go, you know who said to me that now? Pico, you know who, who moved you? Yes. You so, no, but, but we, we were success. Hey, hey, do, you know, do you know who was trying to move you? Yeah. We had a character in biking who's yeah. quite here. Yeah. Mrembo Uno. Mrembo can be. Mrembo is the one who organized the party. Mrembo is the one who organized the party. Mrembo can be. I understand. And I will tell you that Mrembo organized guys to DNK. That's what I mean. I never went to DNK. No, but as far as I, the report I have, even hey. if you yourself were po- pushing that. No. And everybody who was around this area here. Yeah. Stage. Around this area in this event. Stage, event, 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 stage event. Dance Club. Yes. Which I am part of. Yes. Eight. Vintage Bands Club, which I'm part of, Centre members. We never posted on our social media. I was... I was... No, but you were busy posting. Go there and check on your page. Why? Go you see, you, know, you are confusing issues, Pico. You are saying... You are behind it. Eh, no. I go from the Rambo. The Rambo. Listen, I can say it yes. on, 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 on an international platform like yes. this. This is in an international platform. Yes. That Murembolo is the one who was behind. So you are trying to sabotage the world. Hey, he was coming with the people... You, you know what's the problem with support? Yes. You think everything is about you. No, 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 no. Yeah. No, no. Murembulo was coming. Oh, remember, uh, Murembulo is a member of a club. Yeah. And he would not be happy for me to host something in his area where they are hosting, especially when he's an influencer. Yeah. And I think. So, so that's my point. Let me tell you what you're talking about. My point is not about, we are not worried about that because we even knew them. Yeah, Murembulo had to know you, can, you can't compare. You see now, no, it, it's, it's an elephant and an ant. Yes. That event is an end to okay. Sapa Yoba brand. Okay. You understand? It's, it's an end to Sapa Yoba brand. But, 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 but you'll agree that uh, you betrayed me. You got to push it. I was not part of the... No, you were part of it. Okay, it's fine. Let's leave it there. Mm-hmm. Let's, leave you, it. You just, you, you, Let's leave it there. You, let me tell you. forgive you. You just want to get you something. Know, you, know, you know I love you. Hey, Pico. You, you just know want that to I get you know something that I love you. to make yourself feel no, good. I know. That, I love you. that is actually a, a, a fallacy of personal attack. It's there in the books. What you are trying to do now, you are feeling so bad. That you are trying no, no. to point something no, that can I, make me look. Why will I? Let me speak. Why will I feel bad? Because the truth oh, is there. So you don't feel bad. Remember, that you me. No, remember it was on social media. Pico, I'm talking about facts. And, I'm and not talking about. I'm not talking about he and say. I'm talking about how do you identify facts? Pico. Here is a proof on social media. It says Sapayopa is hosting on this day. Mm. Here is proof on Capacino's page where this event is taking place. No. When you take that and put it together. It, What's it, your page? It, 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 it is not like that. Not no, no, even, it's fine. No problem. Not even, go to your page. Not even on mine uh, personal. And no, you know, go to your page. No, man. Pico, oh, it's king. You okay. know what I'm saying? That Remember, hey, I, remember I even asked you a question. I called you as a DJ. What's going on here? Because I've been sending this poster. I said speak to Mrembolo. Yes, but it was in your page. Pico, which page? In, your, in one of your pages. Which page? I'll get it and send it to you. Assembly. Okay. All I'm saying is that people, you don't have to feel bad because I know no, I'm not. when we are together, yes. when we don't have cameras and microphones, yes. I know you apologize. But because we but, have cameras... But, but I already apologized to you. I only when you, we are outside. You, you know, even, you know, even, you know, even you, after you, we sit them off. You know what? You know, you, know, you know one thing about me. By the way, Prof is my leader, producer. Ne? I'm a leader that acknowledge wrong. By the way, Prof is my producer. Yes, prof. I, I, I acknowledge after wrong. After this, after we switch off. The first thing this man is going to say is that, my brother, I am sorry. No, but I apologize to you. Remember. Yeah. But, but before that, that, I must accept criticism. Before that, people you think of criticism, I must apologize. Because you are a great guy, ne? Yes. And then I wish Sapa can see that. And I wish Sapa can utilize a person like you. We're going to have a future as a club. Genuinely. Me? No. Remember. Pico, I wish... But I just wish people who are on their high horses, they can come down and notice and realize who you are. Yes. And then unfortunately, your hands are becoming full now. Yes. But Understand? remember, DJ, it, it, let, me, let me tell you something about uh, the club. 
I think we led. Mm. We're leaders of the club and so forth. And we understand what's going on. People did not want to learn. Mm. Why? Because some of them thought they know much. Mm. Uh, right now, our responsibility is to save the brand. Yes. How do we save the brand? We save the brand on a way with... Look, in fact, uh, we don't even need to lead. People know these guys are capable of this. But why are you advertising yes, the Northwest tour without Sapayop? No, because remember, the members themselves, Shangarai came to the chat and he said, the tour is not part of the programs of Sapayop. I must not use the logos of the club. And he was talking, to my understanding, as a decision taken by them as a president of other region. And I respect it. Hey, they gave, someone. They gave someone, someone an opportunity yes. he was looking yeah. for. As a disciplined member. I no, 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 no. It's, a, it's an opportunistic businessman. No, no, no. I'm a disciplined leader. <laughs> <laughs> so if they say to me, I, I, I would you know, tell you, you that know, you know me, what I'm scared of. Let me of, tell you something. Yes. I would tell you that if that committee decided that Sapa Opa shouldn't be part of that tour, ne, I can bluntly say that committee is full of fools. Yeah, but it's their decision. Yeah, but I, I give, give people, them. you are like, these fools are now playing yeah. on my hands. No, no, I give them an opportunity because remember, uh, people no. think that people are made by Sapa Yopa. But fine, if Sapa Yopa comes and say, let's talk, Pico, can we come back again? What are you going to say? No, but remember, I'm now, as we're speaking, in partnership with M109. Yeah. So if Sapa Yopa wants to come on board or be part, Mm. I still need to go and consult with M109. Oh, oh, oh. So that is actually the process. And the reason being is, uh, some people in the club think or thought that, no, Pico has been made by Sapa flag, while Pico has been already and made. Do you know what people say, Pico? Yes. From outside? Yes. There are people who are saying, you killed the Sapa rally by organizing that free event in North No. West. Because, no. Prof, no. the Northwest event, no. yeah, we are cutting it. They say time. The Northwest event, it's a star than event. Pico has relationships with artists and has money. He books with Tigre Mama. You know what he says at the end of the day? The event is free. You see, if we are running a charity, <laughs> why are we charging people? Yeah. I said even before, when I was still a general of Sapayopa, you said, killed Sapayopa, right? No, when I was a, a general of Sapayopa, just go back and remember. Ne? I said, even in 2018 and 2016, in 2017, if you give me this machinery, you must know it's going to be a free event. Ladies and gentlemen, Listen, free event. Ladies and gentlemen, because sponsors and suburb is capable. I'm wrapping up my show. free event. I'm wrapping up my show right now. <laughs> I am sitting with a mole and agent that was sent inside Sapayopa to destroy Sapayopa. <laughs> but I still <laughs> think there's a lot we are going to say. Uh, me and him, he's a friend of mine. He's a very uh, guy who has the heart of Sapayop. Some of the things we said, we're going to say it. Uh, Ibile, we are saying it more and not behind the closed doors because people are saying horrible things behind closed doors. Yes. Now all I'm saying I can own up yes. with, I can own up with everything I say or write on social media. No, but I don't want to kill Sapayop. You don't own to that. What? You, you must not say, I want to... I'm build, trying to... I want to build Sapayo. I'm, I'm talking to... I want to... The same way you want to build is the same way I want to build. I, I'm talking but to my we, camera now. Yeah, we, we, we have only different... Can I talk to my people, people okay. that are there when no, you're not there? No problem. Okay. The subscribers. Okay, okay. So, all I'm saying is that he's a very interesting man, uh, but I also know his love for charity and love for the club and love and uh, for business and attention. All I'm saying is that, Pico, this is your home. When you have a program in Limpopo, Please come. Let's shoot them because there's still more that people can learn from you. And I want to tell you personally, I respect you a lot, my brother. And I love you. And I want to see you succeed because I know that your success uh, helps and affects a lot of people. I don't know how many times I came to you when I'm in trouble and you rescued me. And you never even spoke about it again. And I want to say that hard. And I know that it's many of us. Even many of those who are saying bad things about you, uh, some were getting married, you were assisted, uh, they stopped getting married, you never asked for anything back, you were there. But yet they still say many bad things about you. Many other people, I think you're, there's millions of friends that are lying outside, but you are doing those things to help. I want you not to get discouraged. I want you, because of us, we are bad people, make you 
to stop being the person that you are. Because once you stop being the person that you are, you are going to deny and deprive many people of the much needed help they need. And as a ferret club, don't fold your arms. Please, come uh, uh, speak. Sarah is a very smart guy. He's actually one of the smartest guys I've met. Uh, I just wish he can stop being conniving and stop lying. He'll, make, it will, he'll actually be a better person if he doesn't do that. Speak to people like him to rebuild this club. But the route is going where members of members must be funded to come and take over the club. We're not going anywhere. Especially for people who don't even understand how the club runs. Who don't even understand uh, 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 how to even organize a rally and event. And one other thing is that there's this thing. They don't understand what builds up your Support was built by even people who are no longer riding. Everyone who put on the, that thing is very important, the patches. There are people who, it's a lifestyle. If you want to compete as a rider, go and compete with Sfiso. I don't want to ride away. It's a lifestyle. There are people who are contributing to this club who are not riding to Devon, who are not riding to Angola. But they contribute and they work for this club. And we've seen it. Live in the past rally, there are people who have never throttled a bike, but they've helped Sapayop. So that thing that we ride, we have bikes, that thing must come down. We must sit as members so that we can make the other generation inherit this club. You understand? And it must also be beyond us. Uh, you know how people have minds over it. I have been approached by many members. Capacino, I think you must come back to lead. I said, hey, I have problems and I have things that I'm working on. I gave you my time. You were quiet when I was dealt with. Right now, let's get proper systems or proper people who can take this club somewhere. But if it needs that maybe former leaders who still have the heart without even omitting them in gala dinners, what, what, maybe the former leaders need to sit down Botili, Mighty, Les Boogie, Spoko, you, eh, 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 Cappuccino, eh, I led. Whether you like it or not, I led. And even after eh, there was a regime change, I've been part of this leadership, one way or the other. All this time we were solving problems, PR problems. I was solving them as a PR guy for Sapayop. That you can change, whether you like it or not. We need to sit down as former leaders, take this club somewhere. I don't know if you're going to even include those you put last year. If you need to, yeah, it's fine. But they must come up with good suggestions because I, when you work with, with people like me, we want smart solutions. If you are going to be there uh, to want to victimize people and what, what, we're not going to entertain that. Hey, we don't want him. Uh, don't put him in a... That's not what we deal with when I'm working there. We're dealing with ideas. We're going to deal with brilliant ideas. So my brother, please... I know that at some point you tell yourself, I, I'm going to leave this thing and focus on my things. Please, rethink, come and guide this club. You are the future. And people, for them to inherit this club, they need people like you. Not me. Me, I won't do anything. Even if I don't do anything, the club will continue. But you, the club, can go further. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you. Uh, we had our rant. It was a psychology thing. We, is, these are two brothers who love each other. Uh, with one who betrayed one and uh, the other, so we were solving it on camera. <laughs> Thank you very much. Pico, you and me are now working on a project, the Northwest Mining in Dawa. Uh, you call me at night, do this, write this, I don't like this document, uh, and all that. And uh, the journey, you've been going to Saudi Arabia about this, you've been meeting people outside the country, investors, even January 8th in Nelspreet, you are also meeting potential investors in this project. How are we looking, Pico? No, look, um, I think, um, firstly, what I want everybody to know is that uh, Northwest is one of the biggest uh, playing province in the economy of South Africa. Mm. And that economy that has been generated there is what makes the world move. Mm. And we have the potential to be able to engage directly with uh, the funders, and uh, not only on the ground, but uh, the guys who are behind the whole thing for the following reasons. It's the right time that we need to bring 
those people right into the northwest because that's where they are trying to make their money. Mm-hmm. Our duties there and our responsibility is to be able to make sure that they, they should understand and know where is their economy coming from. We are going to make sure, we are going to create a platform, we are going to create the best in Daba. Mm. That will definitely, even in about maybe two, three years from now, will be one of the best in Daba in the world. Trust on that. Mm. Because I know the interest of everyone right now is in the Northwest. The platinum mm. is there. Uranium is there. Gold is there. So there's a lot of other... Uh, minerals that definitely they need mm-hmm. and the system is changing because of the g7 program and etc mm-hmm. so we'll run it and i think what is important is the is for people to understand the value chain yes in mining we have your suppliers we have the the the, the, the biggest stakeholder which is the employees the mining employees themselves we have the management and everything uh also there are many people who don't understand how to take part, especially as business people uh, uh, in mining. We hear there's this elite people who are supplying and working with mines. We want to break those barriers so that our people can enter there because uh, most of this manufacturing, maintenance is still owned by white people. And it would be nice that we also channel other black people uh, to come in and understand what's happening. So that's actually the beauty of the mining in that. Yes, but I think what we also need to look upon is that... Uh one of the main reasons why should it be happening in the Northwest, it's because we have issues, for example, that uh, my uh, landowners mm. in the Northwest are not being appreciated mm. and they're not being even guided appropriately in terms of that because the investor thinks is in charge mm. and he thinks his money rules and his decisions and all of that. So it would be more for us to have that uh, done where we know that uh, uh, landowners and others, how can they come forward in terms of participation on such? Mm. We were just talking now about issues of uh, procurement processes and the others and also the, the way things are. You'll find that in most mining areas, the locals are not benefiting. Where the locals are benefiting, it would be out of 100%, it would be maybe a quarter of a percent. Mm. So that will assist and I believe it will also create growth mm. uh, into our communities because we have, for example, um, we have, uh, a, how can I put it, let's say Northwest. Northwest should have not been the poor, the, one of the poor uh, with the resources uh, it has. A province with such resources that they have. Mm. It would have been look like a, maybe the Dubai mm. of South Africa. They might not have a sea, but they got the minerals that can change and create a city, a very proper, strong city there. But mm. we don't. We, what do we find in return? We find potholes, uh, trucks that are right, that driving there, mm. damaging the roads, and then all such things. So those are the kind of things that we're looking at. But I think that when you come back more. again, yes, we are going to deal specifically with uh, this project. Uh, and, and I know that you are also hiding the fact that you are working with other mines in Angola, where you don't call me when you go. Uh, maybe in front of the people, you will also call me to have a slice in that. Yeah. But thank you very much for coming to our program, my brother. No, that's good. Thank no, thanks, thanks for the opportunity. Mm. And please keep it up, making sure that this program goes forward. And I forgive you whole lot. No, but you know that I don't have any crisis. And, uh, <laughs> you know... <laughs> Yeah. Just talk with DJ Cappuccino. Yeah.